Hi, I'm Elizabeth at the Radford Public Library and I have a book recommendation for you if you're someone who likes suspenseful, dark, gritty, noir-like stories. Um, the book is titled The Familiar Dark and it's written by Amy Ingle. She previously wrote The Roanoke Girls, which was very popular. Uh, the epigraph in this book is a quote from Emily Dickinson. And that quote is, we grow accustomed to the dark when light is put away. And as this story opens, the light is definitely put away for the main character, Eve Taggart, who has just lost her 12-year-old daughter, Junie. Her daughter has been found murdered, and Eve is on a mission to uncover what happened. So this is set in the Missouri o Ozarks. Uh, you you meet lots of interesting characters, many of them who are very harsh and fierce, not, not the least of which is Eve as the story progresses. She moves from someone who managed to become a very loving, caring, protective mother, despite the fact that she was raised from the very opposite kind of mother. And this book was compared to uh, Sharp Objects by Gillian Flynn and uh, with great reason there's a lot of interesting relationships and family dynamics that happen in this book as well as interesting relationships between the siblings and the setting is very haunting uh, so that is similar to The Familiar Dark if you've read it and you liked it you might like The Familiar Dark another comparison is for Winter's Bone which is written by Daniel Woodrell and came out some years ago and was made into a movie. I believe this was set in the Ozark, so the setting in this one is, and the environment is very sim similar to The Familiar Dark. Uh, so those are just a couple of comparisons as a basis that might help you determine whether or not you're interested in this book. I actually listened to the audiobook through Overdrive. It was shy of seven hours long and was narrated by Lisa Flanagan and it was so well done. I appreciated the pace at which she read. Sometimes things for me are narrated too slowly, uh, but she does such a great job with the pacing. She does a remarkable job with the different voices and bringing these characters to light in this believable way. Um, so we do have the audiobook on Overdrive, the ebook on Overdrive, as well as the physical book. If you're interested in this, we have it here for you and we can get it out to you. Thank you so much for listening. Stay safe and we'll have another book recommendation for you soon.